Hi, welcome back to another episode of Southern Bell Unboxing. I am Roger Hernandez. And this week we are going to be uh, unboxing, or, or technically unbagging, uh, kind of a mixture of all my Disney stuff for the past few weeks. Um, it's been from random stores, from Walgreens to Hot Topic, Box Lunch, uh, Toys R Us, and um, GameStop, I believe, for one of them. Um, so yes, yeah, so I'm not gonna go into detail which one, you know, of course was from where, but oh, and uh, Think Geek was the other one, not GameStop. Um, so first, I am going to show you. I'm gonna say this one, cause this one is the Belle with the gold dress, and she is absolutely stunning. Oh my gosh, she's got the mirror and everything that she looks into for the enchanted images. So beautiful. Um, we in fact have the uh, the peasant bell too, right? Yeah, yeah. So um, that's gonna go along with this. So I got that one. Barnes and Noble's was peasant bell. Yeah, Barnes and Noble was peasant bell on clearance. Free. Oh, we got we free. got all free. We that's right. We had a five dollar coupon. It was five dollars on clearance. We had a five dollar coupon free. Actually, they ended up paying us money 70 back. Cents. Seventy cents. they gave us back. Um, this one here. Um, where did we get this one from? That one we got from Thinky. Thinky. Okay. And that one too. This one too, yes. So this one here, we got, I just realized what you did. <laughs> oh my God. No, no, no. Barnes and Nobles was that one. These two were thinking. I know. I'm saying, the, the, yeah, the, yeah. I said not to buy this one though because it wasn't on clearance. But we, she gave it to us, remember? Oh, she was like, right. oh, just give it to them for the $4.99. Yeah. Oh, that's right. That's right. I remember now. She overrode it. Okay, so yeah. So now we had Peasant Bell in the room and then we've got gown, ball, ball gown, bell, and then now we got beast. So now we have the whole set. So I'm super excited. So I'll show y'all here on the side what the whole set looks like. When these first came out, I didn't really like dorbs. I was kind of against them because they look kind of, you know, cartoonish and, and not so cute, but they actually kind of grew on me. I, I do like them and I'm happy I got the whole set. So I'm super happy now. <laughs> <laughs> um, next, I'm going to show you another one we got from Think Geek as well. Oh, yeah. um, this is Jasmine, and she's part of the new Disney Princess collection that just came out. Um, she is so cute. I love, I don't know if you can tell because of the, the glare, but mm. her like dress sachet or whatever it is, it. it's very um, clear and, and blue. And it's, it's very pretty. I absolutely love it. I'm going to show you the back, though, of the different ones that are in that collection. Now, I've looked at all of them. This is the only one I really, truly love. Um, simply because I'm not a huge fan of Merida. I, I, I like her. I love the movie. I love Brave. But she's not a classic Disney for me. So that's why I'm, I'm totally against her. I would love Mulan. Love her. But she's hard to find. Everybody's like, yeah, she was first to go. And uh, Aurora uh, is the other one. Um, I, I don't know. I, I like her pink dress. The blue dress is the chase. I think both pink and the blue should have been the variant, and I think they should have had the splash of the two together like they do in the movie as the chase figure. That would have been amazing. That would have been worth my time. But none of them have the clear um, prettiness to it as um, Jasmine does. I haven't seen Mulan in person, so I don't know. But I know for a fact Merida and Aurora are just plain Jane. They, there's nothing fancy or schmancy to them. So, but I love Jasmine. Um, next, we got this from Box Lunch. Um, this was a total surprise. I, we were debating on whether or not to get him or not. And I was like, you know what? No, let's put him back because I don't have any others. And um, Carlos surprised me and actually got them. So <laughs> thank you for that. Um, now, we just, <laughs> now we just need to get Lumiere and Mrs. Pot and uh, Chip, Chip. And then we'll have the whole set. Wait, don't. I didn't know that don't. was thing. Yeah. So um, here's all the others. We already have Peasant Bell. So now we just need to get Lumiere and Mrs. Pot and Chip. And I've actually seen Mrs. Pot and Chip a few times at Toys R Us. Yeah. So next time we go, we'll definitely keep an eye out for, for him or her, them. Yeah. Um, next up, I am super excited for this. So before, whenever we went to Toys R Us, they had the little clearance section. We found the Tsum Tsum of Beast. We have been looking and looking and looking for Belle. Could never find her. We always found Lumiere. And Lumiere doesn't really look like Lumiere. But we found Belle in the Tsum Tsum. 
so excited. So now I have Beast and Belle. Uh, she's super cute. I love how she's got the little bun on the top and her dress is like a felt uh, shimmery goldness just like in her movie dress. She's so cute. I absolutely love her. Love her. Your nails match too. Oh yeah, my nails match. <laughs> They're uh, maroon with gold. Um, and last but not least, this was at Walmart. Yes, Walmart. Um, oh yes. She is to complete the bells that I have. So I already have peasant bell, and I already have ball gown bell already. So now I have a castle ground bell. And um, out of these, these were, these were the only ones I really wanted. I would like Ariel, but I'm not going to be too picky. Um, I'm more of a Bell and you know Beauty and the Beast kind of gal. Oh, there we go. I, I do love Ariel. Ariel, Pocahontas, and Aladdin are are right right up there at second. So Beauty and the Beast is first, and Pocahontas, Ariel, and, and uh, Aladdin are, are right there tied for second. Um, so yeah, so I'm kind of super excited for my little Disney haul. So uh, yeah, so I've actually completed two sets with this. Mm -hmm. So I completed the Tsum Tsum, oh, three sets. So I completed the Tsum Tsum, we got Beauty and the Beast now. Oh, yeah, right. I cast the ground bell, because I got Peasant and Classic Bell. And then I've got uh, Classic Bell, Beast, and I already have Peasant Bell. Mm -hmm. Starting this off, I will not complete this set just because I don't, I'm against Merida and Aurora. And then, um, Hopefully, we'll get to complete this set here when we find Lumiere and Mrs. Pop and Chip. So, stay tuned. Some more exciting stuff coming soon, and y'all take care.